This video will show you how presets are arranged and stored, how to search for a preset and finally how to organize your favorite or custom presets in your favorites folder. We highly recommend you store all your custom presets and favorites in your favorites folder, so you can easily import your favorites folder when there are Studio Artist upgrades. Studio Artist has several modes of image generation, which you can get to with this pull-down menu. Each mode has presets, except these interactive modes. Warp, Adjust, Selection, and Bezier. Presets are arranged by collections and categories. Except favorites which only have categories. This bar lets you view the factory presets, presets you recently used, your favorites, which we will discuss in a moment. And lastly, there is a search mode for presets. The search option only works on the current mode that you are in. So, for instance, if you are currently in the paint action sequence mode, as we are now, the search will look for presets, in that mode only. If you want to do a general search, you can search your presets folder in the Finder or Windows Explorer. You can search by name, tip, category, or all three. There are two ways to save a preset to your favorites folder. One is through File, Export, and then choose the type of preset you want to export. You need to choose the correct mode that the preset was created in. For instance, we are in the Paint Action Sequence mode right now, and this preset is a Paint Action Sequence preset, so you will need to choose Export Paint Action Sequence preset in this list. If you were in the Paint Synthesizer you would choose Export Paint preset. But a better way to save a preset is by holding down the Control key on Mac or right-clicking on Windows and mousing down on the preset icon here. Then choose one of the following options. Option 1 is to choose Export, and then navigate to your favorites preset folder in the Studio Artist folder. You can create a new subfolder at this time as well if you want, and then save it there. Option 2 is to save it to your current favorites folder. You can see what favorites folder is currently active through this pull-down menu here. Then your when you save your new preset will appear as an icon. It will also appear in here in the presets window under your favorites. Option 3 is to create a new favorite category and name it. Also the new category will become the current category. There are no icons here yet, because we have not saved any presets into this category. Now you need again to control click or right click to save, and choose copy current preset to current favorites category. And now the icon has appeared in the new category. If you mouse over the icon it will tell you the name of the preset. You can also find this new preset in your favorites in the preset window. If you are editing a preset, you can overwrite your old preset by choosing Export, Edited Preset to your current favorites category. If you want to save an edited preset in another category folder, other than the current favorites, you can hold down the Shift key and then mouse down on the preset icon. You can then save it to any favorites preset folder that you like. There are a few more options when you control click for Mac or right click on Windows and mouse down on the preset icon. You can get info about the preset. And you can update the current preset icon with whatever image is in the canvas. You can rename the preset or edit the preset help. You can also delete the preset, but we don't recommend this generally. And you can reset the current browser. You can use this if you import a preset and want it to show up right away in the preset browser window. The Reset Browser to Current Preset Location is very helpful when you use Search. Let me show you how it works. I am going to search for Angular. Now I will choose this preset. The only thing is I don't know where this preset is stored. So if I choose Reset Browser to Current Preset Location it will take me to the category and collection of this preset. So this tells me that this preset is in the Still Art Paint Action Sequence Scripts collection, in the Natural Media, with Vector Paints category. Another way to find the location of a preset is to mouse over the name and the file path will appear. And that's pretty much everything you need to know about preset management in Studio Artist. Have fun with the presets!